Well, fans, time for you to tweet your photo using hashtag KC fan photo for a chance to have it shown during tonight's game broadcast. Brought to you by AT&T. Take some skills to do that now, folks. Of course, in a that lot thing of thing pops, though, yeah. and a lot of bubble gum. That's the side. Johnny Cueto, as you can see, very intense. Just has still got entertainment right there. Just has a real hard time relaxing. Yeah, that's a shame. <laughs> what? Yeah, here we go. There's an art to that. Well, <laughs> preserve it. All right, with that, let's uh, check in with Dana Larson in the studio for a Chevy game break. Look at Berlin going to town with the bubble gun. It's pretty impressive. Johnny Cueto working the bubble gun. Somebody got him. At least it's not the hot foot. Oh, wacky. Less painful, more embarrassing. TJ Rivera is on deck. The man at second base, and Garrett Cole. Does not uh, the know. old bubblegum trick. Yeah, he does not know what's happening around him, and everybody's. Well, that is a physics lesson, isn't it? Yes, Jerry Sands, they got wizard. Him. They got him with the bubblegum tattoo. Down in the fifth inning with two on base. Kobe Price with the, the highlighters. He's working the scorecard tonight. Find out, like, when he goes in to after the game take a shower he's going to wonder now, how long has that been up there. Oh he's fixing the other guy's hat you might want to look in the mirror pal. Oopsie Daisy. <laughs> Oops. When rosters expanded. <laughs> One of the premier uh, bubblegum blowers Matt Latos. That's your Dono Ventura and who do you think is responsible for that. Bubble on the top of his hoodie. I would guess that that's Salvi. We haven't seen a lot of bubble heads this year. We've seen a lot of bobble heads, but we haven't seen many bubble heads, and there's a key to that. <laughs> you know, you got to make sure you. you... It's got to be that guy. I mean, you've got, what, 35, 40 guys in that dugout. Somebody's bound to be the victim. Yeah. But good composure by Lance McCullers and Fires right there. It would not be spring training if that did not happen to a player. Ah, yeah. God, Pittsburgh. Our fans don't have a whole lot of fun over there because the Pirates are so tough at home. And their fans are not enjoying this weekend at all so far. Not as much as Jose is. Look at the, 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 the frames on the side. Nice well, work. you've been talking. Wait on deck. Oh, we got a contest going on. That's not going to be good in the beard of Andrew Castor if that thing bursts. Get a little protection right there from Casey Kelly. Marcus Stroman. What is that on my back? Oh, it's a bubble. Uh oh. <laughs> Who did it? Look at nobody's looking. Nobody's giving they're, it up. Not, not a chance. I bet you it's that guy sitting right next to him. And Jose Ramirez. Poor guy has, has no, no idea, and nor should he. He, he doesn't know. You know what? He'll he'll figure it out a couple great. innings. <laughs> uh, what's going on? He finally figured it out. He's Somebody figure it. That mean dry? Maybe it does. More high drinks, Tom. <laughs> Poor Tommy. Hopefully he knows. I'm gonna say he doesn't. Well, the Phils have an eight-nothing lead, and everybody's having fun. Aaron Nola says, "What? Wait, what's what's going on? What's on my hat?" And he realizes now that he is the victim of the ever-popular. 
Yeah, this guy may not think that that's really funny. Plus, it also tells you that there's nobody that he knows is watching the game, or they'd be texting him. Josh Donaldson has got too much time on his hands. All right, who's, who's going to be the victim? Looking for a victim now. Who is it? And he's got two, of, and it stuck to his fingers. It didn't come off. <laughs> Swinging him. Now this is something Gibby would do to one of his teammates right there. No, I wouldn't. Yes, you I've would. I've never done that, that but I. And that would be tame for you. I've witnessed it many times, and he's got no clue. <laughs> no clue. Panarin and will put it away, and that's Buck Showalter will mention that first when the game is over, no matter what the score. It drives him crazy that these bullpens in ballparks can be within the field of play. Well, you know, Vince Scully, uh, who retired at 88, said, they said, Oh, my goodness. Did you get another he piece? He just of put that? another one. He did. He just put another one in there. I'll have to keep an eye on that. He might be going for some sort of a bubble record. Five? Did he just say five right there? Did he say five or five zero? Last year it was night. And there he is, and you see the heavily bandaged left hand and the hot fine headgear worn by Yasiel Puig sitting with Alberto Cayaspo. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Well, they're having some fun down there, aren't they? Why not? Captured in a moment where I did something we used to do in the little leagues, and and I threw in a uh, you know a wad of gum, and they had me on film. They had the audio. Pudge hits a home run, and then we had our uh, we had our gum thing. You know the yeah. Angels had the monkey, we had the gum, right? <laughs> so that was your rally. A big league skipper, and winning the division. Uh, I wonder if that's Andrew's version of a rally count. I don't know. We have a four run lead. I'm not sure. Wonder where all the all the skippers. Ah yes. Remember the youngster that said I'm here for the bubble machine? Well now he's busy with his own. <laughs> Enjoy every minute of it, young man.